Hey guys, I'm in today we are starting something new. Now I know I do this a lot. A lot. Um, but I'm gonna be starting the 100 baby challenge. Uh, this is a challenge that I've been wanting to do for quite a while. I kind of started it on Phil Life, but it didn't really go anywhere. Um, so I'm just, I'm, I'm just gonna start again. Um, so this is our, our main girl. She's got summer date. She is... Uh, she wants a big happy family, she is family oriented, oriented an art lover, and she is creative. I just thought she might need a good way to get income. So, like, painting is like one of the best ways to do it. Um, so let's just go through her outfits quickly. This is her everyday, this is her formal. I kind of like the, uh, the long skirt there. And her athletic, her sleepwear, that was I just randomly um, made that. I didn't actually have much input on that one, but hey, that's her party wear, her swimwear, her hot weather, and her cold weather. I kind of like the hat. The hat's kind of cute. So, yeah, that is sum up. So, let's head into this challenge. Uh, yeah, um, I have the rules uh, thought for the, uh, the 100 baby challenge. Let's just get into the house. I have one house that I've been thinking of. Oh, it's an apartment, and it is that one. Because it is on the ley line, and it's good, good schools. Um, I'm just going to have it furnished for now, and then I'll, I'll think about, like, renovating it myself. Right, so the rules are, your matriarch cannot get pregnant by the same sim twice, that's fine. Now the fathers can move into the household, so that's fine, and they can't assist the household in any other way. Next one, all traits and aspirations of the, your children have to be randomised, that's fine. So I can feel like we're going to get some weird aspirations and traits. You are not allowed to influence any, which gender the baby will be, that's absolutely fine. Now this one, you are not allowed to use mods, custom content and cheats. I don't actually have any custom content on my uh, sims at the moment, but I do have mods. I'll just show you guys what mods I have. I have the pregnancy overhaul. Doesn't change the gameplay in any way, so... Um, team marriage and pregnancy. Again, I don't think we'll need that one because we're, we're playing with her. And she's a young adult. I do have the uh, MC command center, but that won't, I won't use it. Um, in any way, and I've got the uh, the go to school mod pack, which um, I won't really play with, to be honest. I mean, I'll just send the kids go to, send the kids to school, and I won't join them. And I've got the uh, the royalty mod as well. Uh, script mods, that's mostly um, MC control. Yeah, let's let's get this started. Let's let's go on an adventure to find a guy. They're women. Who are you? Alice Mar Aren't you the, uh, the girl that comes with Stranger, the Stranger Land place? I forgot my scores. <laughs> right. <laughs> totally know what gameplay there is on The Sims. Right, let's have a look. Let's unpause, let's see if we can get some guys in, in, out in here. I mean, we could totally break up marriages. Um. I, mean, I haven't finished with the, reading the rules. Uh, yeah, we could break up marriages. We could just like go crazy with this. Is that our first guy? Hello, good sir. I knew the guy with the funky uh, blazer that you usually wear. Um, right. So the, uh, the other rules are: you can use nanny services or any other hired help, uh, but you cannot use free services. Or, can't use the free services reward trait, that's fine. Uh, you are allowed to join and create clubs, but you're not allowed to use certain club perks. That's fine. I don't tend to play around with clubs that much anyway, so I don't think that's going to be much of a problem. And last one, once a child becomes a young adult, they are free to move out of the house and make room for new babies. So they can never move back into the house. That's fine. Just get rid of the kids. Just get rid of them. Don't want them. See, I went for Tate because I was like, it was randomized. I randomized her name and Tate came up and I was like, the first person I thought about was Catherine Tate. I don't know why. I just thought, it, like, why don't we just have a kid that is called Catherine and uh, we'll make her a bit of a comedian. 
hug, ask about career. Oh, um, some is cute, it's full, like, oh my god. Oh, and he's an art lover. Oh, well suited for uh, summer then. I mean, we do need to get her um, friendship up to the max before we can really start doing the romance stuff. Give him the apartment key already. I don't think we can do that considering the rules, um, because the, uh, the, the father can't. Oh, he's single as well. Oh! Um, yeah. Has to join a household. I can't do that. So I ha- I... Where are you going, Ned? Ask about that. Oh, did- What? Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, you go back into your house and we'll call him over. What? You can't invite him. Tra travel. Just, just travel with him. He, he will see me there. Okay, okay, let's find a nice place. I mean, it's a bit romantic over here. We, yeah, let's it's, it's go for a bit, you no, know, a bit romantic. Go for our first date. I mean, it's not an official date, but you never know. Oh, what are you wearing? Oh, he's got tattoos. Oh, he's uh, a bit edgy. Well, let's just try and get this friendship up. I mean, hopefully I can have a bit of fun with this, uh, this series. I mean, I've seen plenty of other YouTubers do the 100 Baby Challenge, and they've, they've done pretty well. So yeah, hopefully we can get, like, a, like a full-on family tree going, and just go crazy. I mean, I feel sorry for, for Summer, because she's gonna have to push out 100 kids out of her. Wait, oh. Wait, where are you going? Come back! Stay. You are not to go anywhere until I am impregnated. Right, I think we can start bringing in the romance stuff. I mean, we're almost kind of, well, we're just over halfway. So I, I'm going to say that we could uh, start bringing in the romance just just slightly, just gradually. Oh, I also have the, uh, uh, what's it called? I forgot what the, the mod is. It's, it's to do with um, the emotions. Meaningful stories, that one. That, that's another one, but that only affects the uh, the emotions. It does make the like other townies kind of have their own stories and make them a bit more lifelike. <laughs> Instead of just like staying in one house, they marry off and just like, yeah, all that stuff. Tell joke about barnacles. Are you a pirate? You might like my joke. Yeah, we're almost there to full... Uh, well, friendship, which is really good. I mean, we could uh, get impregnated on the very first episode. Where are you going? Come, come back. Come. There you go. You are not to leave. And uh, compliment appearance. Have a compliment. Blurs a little bit. Go on. Confess attraction. I st that one doesn't tend to work very often. But I mean, we could try. <laughs> Alright, her romance is starting to go up a little bit. It's blur. Oh, he likes it. Blur again. Hold hands. Whisper seductively. Come on, girl. There you go. Stop walking off. Is, is he going home? I have a feeling he's gone home. Yes, yes he has. Come on, Diego. Come and see my lovely house. He will be right up. Oh, he's here. That was quick. Come on, let's get this first kiss. Let's do this, girl. Oh, Ooh, he accepted it. Embrace. Let's get a bit of flirting in there. Has to be boyfriend. There we go. So Diego is our first guy. <laughs> hey, they're boyfriend and girlfriend now. That Mr. a kiss. And we got the boos, I think. Uh, try for baby and shower. Come on, girl. Let's do this. Put it away. I feel like I should censor this. <laughs> right. Pregnancy test. Let's do this. Oh, she's not pregnant. Aw, oh, come on. We gotta do it again. <laughs> We're gonna keep going until this happens. Right. Pregnancy test. There we go. We have our first child. So we have our first child and I think that's a good... Oh, he's left. I think that's a good segue to, to end the video there. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope that this series can go well. I mean, it started off pretty well, I think. So we're going to leave it there and I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one.
both know when it's right.